Hey everybody, how's it going? It's Chrono Trigger time again. Yay! The best time. Finally, um, I'm back. Uh, last time we basically did the... Oh, we, um, repopulated that forest and, um, there was like that whole scene with Luca's mother and everything. Uh, so, yeah, we did that side quest. We've only got one more to go and then we have... To, then we can basically get to the end of the game. So let's, uh, without further ado, head over uh, to the next area where we gotta go. So, oh, actually, wait, hold on. I was going to real quick change the party up, I think. Uh, the only two characters that don't know all their texts yet are Ayla and Magus, so I'm gonna throw them in, in the party just so I can hopefully level them up some more. And then basically, um, well, I'll, I'll show you guys. Uh, once this side quest is over. This one, if memory serves, might take... Actually... Hmm. We'll see We'll see where we end up here. Um, but it might possibly take two parts. In which case, um... We... Will have to... I mean, basically... It'll be two parts of this, and then it'll be the end. Which will probably be at least three, I would think. Or at le least two with one very long one or two potentially long parts i don't know yet but we'll, we'll see how it goes either way we the end is definitely near um now that i'm actually <laughs> doing this uh like playing this game uh look there's robo working hard again that's funny it's funny that he's become like part of this uh era because of just leaving him there okay so oh. What the hell? Okay, hold on. Let me let me look at here. I gotta remember where I'm supposed to go. Okay, I am in the wrong area. Okay, let's go this way. Do 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 do. So this is the Black Omen, by the way. Just while we're here, this we're gonna take this thing to um to the end of the game, basically. Because there's I'll explain it later. Giant's Claw. So here we are. Now, do you remember uh, Toma, the guy, when we did Frog's uh, side quest, the guy that you poured soda on his um, grave? He told us where this was, which is how, how I got back here. And, uh, well, actually, let's see. Speaking of Toma, Toma's crumpled nut note. Those holes, what if I jump into them on purpose? Yes, I'll start back at the beginning, and so here we go. Whoa, man, what's this? Look familiar, huh? What? Why Reptite's castle here? Prehistoric castle. Yep. So basically it's the Tyranno Lair. Cool, huh? And it's got that like badass awesome like Tyranno Lair music. So yay. I always thought this was cool that this part reappeared because this is, again, the Tyranno Lair was always one of my favorite uh, parts of the game, so. Um, yeah, I always thought it was really cool that, like, it just randomly pops back in, you know? Okay, oh, I can have a Magus use lightning to, to as well. Yeah, I was thinking that it was probably good to have Chrono with me for the lightning, but I, I, for some reason, I forgot that Magus could also use lightning, too. So, what are you gonna do? Oh man, it's good to be back. It's uh, it's pretty cool that I'm now playing two really badass Super NES RPGs on the channel. Um, obviously wrapping this up and playing Earthbound, which I've been really enjoying. We've only done two episodes as of this recording, but um, believe me, it'll uh, it's uh, <laughs> there'll be a lot more where that came from, so it'll be fun. I'm like really stoked about it. So I think this is pretty much the. Um, okay, I guess I gotta go the other way. This is pretty much the Tyranno castle exactly, but backwards. So in other words, since that's the... Since we encountered first the, uh, like, the throne where, like, Azala's throne there, I think we're going, like, back towards, like, the beginning of it, if that makes sense. It's like the, uh, the castle's, like, inverted the way we came in, and obviously instead of, like, having those cool balconies and stuff, we have instead the, um... Now let's use lightning two on it. Okay, uh, instead of those cool balconies and stuff, we have... It's just, like, underground. It's pretty neat. I love the idea that this, uh, castle's been sitting 
Ooh, that did nothing. Oh, crap. Let's try Dino Tail, see how that works. But, uh, I love the idea that this, uh, castle, like, <laughs> survived literally millions of years. Um, crap. It's gonna, like, obviously, like, respond. That really sucks. But yeah, I love the, the idea that the Tyranno Lair just, like, like, lasted for millions of years underground, you know? It's a wonder that, like, nobody found it until, like, Chrono. Or Toma, I guess, technically. It's Toma. Was the one that, uh, told us about it. <laughs> nice dance, Ayla. Whoa, giant, like, dinosaur tail. Okay, um... Ah, come on! Annoying. These bats are really annoying. Come on! Okay, are there any combo moves I can use? Let's try Falcon Hit, I guess. Falcon Hit! Instead of, like, Falcon Punch, you know? <laughs> That's a cool move. I always thought that one looked kind of badass. Cool, that should do it. A Lizard Dactyl. Oh man, speaking of dinosaurs, um, the trailer for the new Jurassic World came out today. Ugh. Ugh, it was awesome. It's like the final trailer. I can't wait for that movie, Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom. It's gonna be great. Can't wait. Oh. Ooh. A kitty cat! Where, the, where did a cat come from? <laughs> That's pretty funny. There's like a cat that fell down randomly. <laughs> Oh, come on, no! Alright, fine. Uh, let's try to do this falcon hit again. It seemed very effective. Do do! Do do do! Do 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 do! I also gotta say, like, this is one of my. I think I might have said it, like, during the actual Tyranno lair part. This is one of my absolute favorite, like, tunes from the game right here. I absolutely love this this uh this tune it's fantastic okay so let's go down Woo! Meow! let's go down okay oh got a couple dum-dums here let's do that i think these guys are actually weak against lightning so let's see what happens uh, i'll use lightning too if this actually like does anything i'm pretty sure it does far away. Oh, let's use Luminaire. Hopefully this will just take him out. Yeah, I've got to just, like, make sure I get the final, uh, the final text for, um, all the characters, because I want that. And Ail only has one more to learn, and Magus has two. It's, Magus kind of a pain, because it's like, you have to, like, basically use him for, like, all the side quests and everything if you really want to. I mean, unless you do, like, a crap load of grinding, which I've done before. Um, with just him in the party, but to catch him up with everybody else, you know, so he actually learns all of his techs. Uh, let's see what's in here. I can't open it, okay. Yes, okay. Nice, a power tab, okay. I should start, I should actually use some of my tabs. I'll, I'll do that at the end, I guess. Hey, more of these things. Leapers, also known as Parasaurolophuses. It break, breaks my heart to, uh, to, uh, destroy some Parasaurolophuses because, uh, they're, uh, they're just, like, the coolest. I love Parasaurolophuses. Uh, I, I, uh, drew a picture, uh, for Rachel when, um, we, when we first started dating, and it was just called, uh, and it was just said, I wrote on it, we make a nice Parasaurolophus, like it was a shitty pun. <laughs> And it was like a picture of two Parasaurolophuses, like, hugging each other. <laughs> sort of like nuzzling each other, and she like, was absolutely delighted by that, <laughs> by that picture. To the point where she framed it, and it's in our bedroom, it's pretty hilarious. Uh, so, uh, what can I say? I'm, I guess I'm quite the charmer, huh? <laughs> Little tip for you guys, uh, if you guys wanna, uh, Court a lady, dinosaurs. Just saying, that's, that's all you gotta do. Just, just uh, show her, 
you know, make some kind of dinosaur-related uh, pun or something, and, and you're all good. <laughs> oh, man, it's funny. <laughs> yeah, so, uh, needless to say, Parasaur Loafs is a uh, hold a soft spot in my heart, and Rachel's as well. I think they're her favorite dinosaur. So, um, yeah. But they were pretty cool. They were, like, pretty sweet. I watched a, a documentary about them and, uh, well, with them on it anyway. Oh, a blue rock. I think the blue rock is, let's see, I think that's a tech one. Let's see. Let's organize this shit real quick. So I know I have a silver rock. Triple tech Omega Flare. Can be used by Luca, Robo, and Magus. Ooh, cool. Okay, nice. Nice, nice. But, um, yeah, so anyway, they could apparently use their horns to, like, stun predators, because it, it gave off such a low frequency, like that horn on the back of their heads. Isn't that cool? Like, I never knew that until... Ooh, a Zodiac cape. I bet you that's for Magus. Uh... A Zodiac cape, huh? Maybe Chrono can use it? What is a Zodiac cape? Now I'm gonna go check again. Okay. Magic defense. Can be used by oh Marley. Okay, good. Alright, so we'll give it we'll give it to Magic Defense plus ten. Wow, oh that's really good. Uh I'm gonna give that to Luca for sure. Okay, um That one was kinda hiding too, wow. This is quite the uh, elaborate maze here. Um, but yeah, that was a very interesting factoid about Parasaur Lofuses that I didn't know. I thought they just used it to like, for like mating and shit like that, but they, they don't. They act, they could actually use it for defense. And apparently if they used, the, they were in like a huge herd of them, it would, like the low frequency would be so ear deafeningly loud it could really stun a predator like badly, which is pretty, it could like scramble their brain. How cool is that? Pretty neat. So anyway, there's your dinosaur factoid. While we're in the Tyranno lair. Very, very appropriate. Oh, I actually didn't mean to use Luminaire. I thought that was lightning too. That works. Cool. Oh man. I'm having one of those moments where I'm like, because I haven't played Chrono Trigger in a while, it's like, why haven't I? <laughs> you know, it's like, I love this game so much. It's like, why have I not done, why have I not been playing it, you know? Uh, oh well. Ooh, see, we're getting close to the to the uh, to the beginning of the. See, like I, how I was saying, it was uh, inverted, basically. Um, we're getting to basically the the beginning of the castle, or the lair, I should say. A frenzy band. What's that do now? See, I'm finding all this cool stuff. Okay, Let's see what frenzy band does. 80% counterattack rate. That's pretty damn good. Wow, okay. Okay, uh, I gotta fight some douchebags, okay. I should really heal up Chrono in a second. Okay, let's do that. Uh oh. That might kill Chrono. Oh, kill Dela. Worse, okay. That sucks. Okay, well, at least Magus is still pr doing pretty well. <laughs> so we're good that way. Boo! Don't use chaos on me. Stop. Stupid thing. Alright, come on. Hold on. Alright, let's see. Okay, was, yeah, keep attacking Magus. That's fine. I'm gonna just have him use Luminaire, and hopefully that'll, that'll kill these guys. Okay. And then I'll have him revive Ayla. Hopefully that works. Oh man, that did not. Crap. Crap. Wow, Babin Luminaire doesn't do shit. That sucks. Alright, come on. Yeah, that's gonna kill... Oh, not Ayla, good. Oh no! 
that was close, okay. I'm gonna definitely heal after this. <laughs> I'm really stupid for not healing. I tend to do that sometimes, especially when I'm like babbling on and on, so. Cool, okay. So let's heal. I guess I'll have her use Kiss, that's fine. She's, uh, just like, smooching up Chrono there and herself. It's kind of funny that she, like, kisses herself, if you think about it. She, she's kissing, uh, Magus, but he's probably all, like, you know, because he's all edgy, you know? He's probably like, eh, whatever, you know? Oh, cool, these guys are awesome. They give, a, give you a lot of, uh... Yeah, lock all you can, yeah. Th these guys give you a lot of tech points, which is great. I need that. Nice. Yeah, 100 tech points. I really needed that. Yes, Magus learned Black Hole. That's great. I don't know why. They I guess it's because they lock your, uh... You know, obviously they block you from using tech, so they're harder to defeat. And I think they also have a kind of a high... Like, it's... You have, there's a good chance that you're gonna, like, actually miss... But we did well. Yay. I gotta say, I don't even really remember, uh... Ooh. Yeah, of course I fell. But I think that's where I needed to go anyway. Cool. Not, uh, not much has changed in this uh, area in, you know, 64 million years. <laughs> that's a long time. Okay, let's see if we can go here. I wonder if there's a save point at all, because I know we're at 17 minutes already. Doo -doo. Yes, there is. Okay. Well, this... I believe there is a boss coming up, so and I think it's in there. So what I'm going to do, guys, this is as good a place as any. Actually, just real quick, I want to see. 79, okay, so we're very close to getting that, and Dark Matters is the last one. What's there's Triple Kick? I don't remember that one. Anyway, um, so... I believe we have a boss battle coming up. So, um, and just given that it's already been 17 minutes, uh, we ha have actually another place to go in the side quest as well. Ooh, I'm gonna save here just in case there's an issue. Um, so I'm gonna just save here, and next time we'll resume and finish this side quest. So until then, guys, I will see you then. Peace.